ಸ್ವರೂಪಿಣಿ ಅವತಾರ ವರಿಷ್ಠಾಯ ರಾಮಕೃಷ್ಣಾ ನಮ ಓಂ ಶಾಂತಿ 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 ಸಲ್ಯೂಟೇಷನ್ಸ್ ಟು ಶ್ರೀ ರಾಮಕೃಷ್ಣ ದ ನೋಬ್ಲೆಸ್ಟ್ ಆಫ್ ಆಲ್ ಅವತರಸ್ ಓಬಾಸ್ ರೆಸ್ಪಾನ್ಸಿಬಲ್ ಫಾರ್ ಎಸ್ಟಾಬ್ಲಿಷ್ಮೆಂಟ್ ಆಫ್ ಧರ್ಮ and himself was the embodiment of all dharmas all religions all righteousness our salutations to that sri ramakrishna <clears throat> during my last introductory talk in mat i uh, just said that when shami vivekananda composed this wonderful pranam mantra about Sri Ramakrishna after doing a puja on 6th February 1888, 1898 in the house of a devotee when Master's marble statue was being installed. He did the puja. After that puja, he made pranam mantra. It is a tradition. Now immediately he composed this sitting on the puja receipt and then all joined him and this. As I told last time, God is one. With certain things we should have in our mind as being the followers of children of Sri Ramakrishna. We should not have any pettiness, any narrowness, any misunderstanding about God big, God small. God is one. But this subject matter is why Shamiji, who did not at all consider Sri Ramakrishna as an avatara, now he is telling this that Sri Ramakrishna is the Avatara Purishtha. There are several causes we can put. And in my last lecture I said the same Pele, I am a follower, a lover of uh, Pele. Uh, I am admirer of Pele, I am admirer of Maradona, I am admirer of some other cricketers, some uh, Hollywood uh, we, uh, the actor, actress. Yes, you, you may be that. It is not that you are actor or actress in all the films or all the movies will be doing the best. Out of one, 10, 20, 50, 100 uh, movies they <coughs> took part, they had their roles. But one movie you like most. So Shami Vivekananda comparing the activities and contributions of other Abhutaras, he just said. And another thing is, one wants to glorify one's own guru. That was, Vivekananda was not that. We have to our, use our intelligence and five years he was coming to Sri Ramakrishna in uh, Dakshineshwar, but never ever going to make pronouns to the temples because he registered his name as a follower of Brahma, Samaj, who believed in the formless aspect of the ultimate reality, which is called Brahma. So their uh, path was recognized as Brahma Shamas. There were many uh, divisions also, as Christianity split uh, in different Muslims, Islam split, Hinduism, so many sects. So in Brahma Shamas also, just after its day, there was Adi Brahma Shamas, there was Shadaran Brahma Shamas, there was Navobitan Brahma Shamas, headed by, founded by Keshav Chandra Shen. Keshav Chandra Shen was uh, before that with Rabindranath Tagore's father, Maharshi, Devanath Tagore. So, so many things were there. A little, little uh, in, in Advaita Vedanta also we find. Shankaracharya, then Ramanuja Acharyas, Shankaracharya's uh, monism, Advaita. Then uh, Ramanuja's uh, qualified monism. Then uh, Madhvacharya's another one, this. Advaita, Vedanta, but Dvaita. Dvaita, Advaita, Vishishta, Advaita. A little, little difference, <laughs> philosophical discussions. You like Advaita, all right, you go. I like uh, Vishishta, Advaita, all right, allow me to go, you like. So, according to Shami Vivekananda's understanding, I will read some of his letters and evaluations <coughs> of why he has said that. 
we are telling Vivekananda said from his point of view, what he believed in. Never ever he would say anything without having personal experience. Vivekananda was not an ordinary person like us. That one day Sri Ramakrishna was telling something and Narendra Nath I was going not uh, accepting. Another elderly of his father says, not in last, not in last, was 20 years, 22 years, a young boy at the time. Uh, he was telling, I don't know, eh? Oof, master is telling, why don't you accept? Before Norin's answering anything, Sri Ramakrishna said, Hello, mister, what is this? Since I have to say that Narin has to, why you are telling? That is not good. Let him understand himself. Never ever accept anything without being convinced of its truth. That was the teaching of Sri Ramakrishna himself. Before he is giving up the, this mortal body coil, Vivekananda, in his presence, when all the intelligentsia, and last lecture I told that, the whole gamut of the uh, Indian sadhu those, those who are uh, very uh, conversant, uh, an expert in this scholarly people, and their lives were also very purely being led, conducted. They were uh, honorable people, respected people in the society, and living their life outside the sadhaka, spiritual aspirin. They say that, yes, we came to have a debate whether Sri Ramakrishna is an avatar or not. One of them said, what avatar? One Pandit scholar, he said, Sri Ramakrishna is that one from where all of the Ruska, not of the So try to understand. And this was said in uh, 15 years back. But uh, Noren would not accept that. Noren, others, Dr. Mahindra Sharkar, having his medical degree from England and from Allopathy, he switched over to homeopathy. And he was the first founder of the Indian uh, Science and Research Institute. Try to understand. A research institute in those days, being a subject, he himself did it. Completely a logical man, an agnostic, an atheist, not taking anything. He also is telling, yes, you people are telling how to. But Master is telling. Ramchandra Dattu, who was giving lecture to Sri Ramakrishna, Bhairavi Brahmani, who was the guru of Sri Ramakrishna, he said she was an exp expert in, in, uh, in Bhagavata. Yeah. What is this Avatara Tattu? Avatara not is a body, it is a human body. It is try to understand. These are this Tattu. Sri Krishna, Paramatma. Sri Krishna is telling Abhijananti Mahagora Manushinto Noa Sritam Param Bhava Majanto Mamo Bhutumasya. Ordinary people with little intellect and the foolish people, what they do? They think Sri Krishna is son of somebody. It's the principle working through this body. Kali, Makali, it is not a, it is black composition, Kalu, it is, how can it be a goddess? Kali is not a murti, it is not a statue. It is a tattva, Brahman. It is not a form, but it is a tattva, a principle. Ultimate reality is a principle. But we cannot understand something which is not concrete, which is invisible, which is formless. Is it that easy thing? So how to, in the beginning, what we do? Small babies, we make them many things to learn. Some for world. <coughs> what is apple? We put an apple. Some sometimes dummies. Just they, they can understand what is that. Something. Can you make understand a small boy, baby, uh, or young, uh, and even we? What is infinite? You you meditate on the infinite. What do you will meditate? In the recorder of the gospel, so highly educated in those days, uh, University of Calcutta scholar, Blue, having stipend, being headmaster in two schools at the high schools in those days in Calcutta, the seat of learning, and uh, being lecturer in different colleges. He, when asked by Sri Ramakrishna, 
What do you believe in? Do you believe in God? I say yes. I say God. God with form or God? <coughs> God without form. <coughs> So, <clears throat> all right, that's good, but keep it in mind that God with form is also equally true. He was confused, but he did not answer because he was trying to argue, and Sri Ramakrishna was giving befitting answers, and he understood that never ever even he would scold me because he was a master always, he used to give scolds to his students. Now, Today he understands I have become a student and I have got a very uh, strong, hard nut uh, teacher. <coughs> My education is. So, whatever he was telling, he was being proved wrong by Sri Ramakrishna. No, you know, this notion is not good. Only God is formless, it is not. How, what about your wife? No, wife is uh, um, otherwise good, but uh, he uh, ignored. I ignored. How can you say? What, do you know what is knowledge? Are you a man of knowledge? So, he understood that this man is not an ordinary man. His uh, talking is in a different, uh, higher level of understanding, which I do not have. He understood. So, Master, when he said, all right, then Master was asking, do you meditate? Have you got anything? Do you, are you fixing your mind in the formless aspect of the ultimate reality? The goal of human life is to realize the God, know the truth, be it with form, be it without form. Be it Jesus, be it God, be it uh, Father in heaven or be it Mother in heaven. But have that understanding that there is a higher power. You believe in form or less. That's the difference. But do you concentrate? Do you, do you see that luminous form of your Ishto Devota? If it is with form, then it will be luminous form. It is not that I am I am having Krishna's darshan, Krishna's darshan, it is Manas Netra, mental eye. I am visualizing. How can I see? Thousands of years. People dream, Jesus Christ, I have, I have. God appeared, revelation. Some voice they are hearing, Rishis, Bodhis. They had that vision, that understanding, that realization, feeling of oneness. <clears throat> I am that, I am one with that ultimate reality, I am not this body. Sometimes Muhammad is telling, Moses is telling that yes, Moses, Moses received a message from God. At another time Muhammad received a message, they say, I have got that message. All right, I'm good. God with form, they came and talked to them. We call it, call it divine revelation. Some divine words come. Or in Rushimini's case, some divine feeling, experiences come. I don't feel that there is any separateness with anything. I am one with everything. Sri Ramakrishna one day after uh, meditation is telling, oh, Holy Mother also is telling, where is my hand, where is my leg? Sri Ramakrishna also uh, telling, uh, where I am, I am. No feeling of, experience of, sense of the uh, physical world, because they are not present in the physical world. Gradually, gradually, they will come. And Master said, a divine mother said, now you remain in Bhava Mukha. And he didn't know what is the meaning of Bhava Mukha. He was asking, Acha, I see. He said, Can you explain, explain it to me? Mother said, now everything you have experienced, whatever your mind wanted. Now what I do, mother? <clears throat> After practicing all the sects within Hinduism and some other major religious faiths, now Sri Ramakrishna, he could not sit idly. He said openly that in the Shrenai only one poem, poem means one uh, uh, sound. Mm, it is, it is main sound will be there, but I like to play it from in a flute, from different holes, different sound it will come. Mm -hmm. I like variety, but I know main thing is one. I have realized that. Why do you fight all the paths? Yatoma, Tatopa. As many paths, so many fights. 
All faiths are part. As many faiths, so many parts. All these faiths are part. But condition is there. I have had divine communion. I know what is that? Purity of mind. Not show. Not fakeness. Fraud. Fake. Gurus. So called religious people. In the name of religion, so many heinous things, crimes are being done. So that will not do. All paths will go to God. Swami Vivekananda quoted, Rajinam Goi Chitra, Dreju Kutilo Nana Patuji Sanginam Ekuga Mustamusi, Vaisam Arna Goi Go. As different streams having their sources in different places, rush to the, mingle their water to the ocean, following crooked or straight path, finally become merged with the ocean. So also different paths, finally you to ocean is one, all the rivers are coming to the ocean only. These are different places, so actually you are going to God. You are giving different names, so don't fight. Many things are there. In the Gita he quoted, Ye atamang prabaddan testam tatrivu bhajanu mamo bhartman vartan Whoever is worshipping me in whatever name, whatever form, I know they are actually worshipping me, finally, they are following my path. But to me, there are, there are not two gods, there are not two ultimate realities, there are not two al almighties, there are not two infinities. Infinity is always one. You cannot say infinities. Infinity is infinity. One infinity. So, Certain things we must have. God played as Avataro, the wonderful Avataro's role in different ages, yugas. Vivekananda, his viewpoint. All Avataros gave their best what was necessary at that time. Mother, when uh, I am mother's son, I am a baby, mother feeds me with all soft things, milk. Then a little grown up, then according to my understanding, and need, and which I can, I will be able to, I will be able to digest, mother, gradually, gradually, changed what I used to eat. So, the whole world, also, perhaps he was still in that, it, there was, civilization was in a very bad condition. Today's a wonderful day, and we all should offer our pronouns to, salutations to Jesus Christ, uh, that he gave his, I will, I will come, his contribution. How? He gave up his life. Buddha, Jesus, Chaitanya, Ram, Krishna, Ram Krishna, Shankara, Guru Nanak. There are so many. And they all live the life for the priest. For the priest, they practice. That is why people feel attracted. You like Lakshmi, you worship that. I like Saraswati, I am worshiping. You like Krishna, you like, I like Jesus. Another one likes Ramu. Don't fight. They are all appearances in different ages with different forms to solve the problems of that time. Nowadays, father and mother's problem is that young boys and girls, their children, very inattentive, mind is no fire, they don't talk to father and mother, always busy with the computer. Not computer, it was some key cell game. Phone. Cell phone, computer, something, something. A video game player, something, uh, what you call that, a, a tablet. The first is a tablet, we know, tablet, medical tablet. <laughs> now it is a tablet. So many things. So many new terms have been coined in the IT, IT section. Try to understand. So Avatara comes, if Avatara comes today, Avatara will solve the problems of today. Not 2000 years back and not those problems will, will come after 2000 years. So we have to understand. So, and I will tell that in the eyes of Swami Vivekananda, who never ever would say anything without having a personal, concrete experience. He was not that type of man. Anything emotionally he would tell, it is not that. So, before his giving up the body, Sri Ramakrishna said, Narayan, still do you have that? He, Mother, divine mother said, you have come to do mother's work. One day you will accept everything. Gradually, gradually, 
your realization will be unfolded. Sri Ramakrishna did not claim that I have practiced all the uh, paths and I experienced that. In the beginning, one, after another, after another. Twelve years in this way it went. His sadhana, different paths. Finally he said, that's chameleon study, he said. A man sitting under a tree and in the tree, uh, in the branches there was a chameleon. And chameleon means it's, it's a time to time, uh, it, it changes its color. So other outside visitors don't uh, used to come to that place. One day somebody came, he found it was a red color, some kind of animal is there. And another day another person came, he found it is it, green. Another day somebody is pink, another day it is blue. So uh, they are fighting and uh, discussing and debating. No, no, it is white. She said, have you seen? I have seen one red color. No, no, it is not red, it is green. Another one, it is blue. Another one, it is pink. pink. So all of them came, came uh, 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 to solve their problem. The who is speaking the right thing because everyone was demand, uh, de demanding that his vision was correct, uh, what he saw. And that man was sitting there and they were trying to see that animal in the a branch of the tree, and then the man sitting there day and night is telling, Why are you are fighting? What happened? You know, we have seen, he is telling it is green, I, am telling, I know it is red, another friend is telling pink, so I have come to see this. Oh, why you are fighting? I am 24 hours under this tree, and not only the colors you have said, four color, five color, sometimes I find without any color, colorless also. That is also one of his attributes. So, how God will play or not play, Bhavo Mukhe Thakur, you remain in Bhavo Mukha after having all the experience of all the major religions, so-called paths uh, to God, and also internal, so many sects uh, in, in, in divisions in Hinduism itself. He unified Hinduism, he unified, urbanized all the religions also. That is also a great contribution compared to other Babutaros in their time. These problems were not there. They were confined in to a locality. Now the globe, world has become a global village. Problems of every corner is coming. So in Sri Krishna's life we find that there would be one day a conflict within all the religions. So he harmonized before having the final disaster. Small, small thing. Prevention is better than cure. See, he tried to prevent the future problems as the creator, as the representative of the creator, as the creator himself embodied in that form. So he did that. And Nanda Nath is telling, he compared to contribution of the others, his contribution is there. Now, one after another is there. Other avatars, they had to show some kind of rajogunas, tamogunas, to we know about the situation, to establish the dharma. Everyone tried to establish dharma. Jesus Christ took a stick in the churches. This Jew, Jewish temple priest, they were doing business in the church itself. There were a market selling and cheating the visitors. And so Jesus took a stick and chased them. So what are you doing in the name of God? Is it God? <coughs> You are cheating people, you are doing business, this is a business place. For business and market is there, other places there. So he took a steel, just a small boy, not a big one at that time. So his conscience was pure. He did it. Ram Chandra had to use the arrow on him. Bali and Shugri, Bali cursed him. Why you killed me? I was not your enemy. I was fighting with uh, Shugri, my brother. I did not do any problem to you. How can you, being God incarnate, behave in that way? Ramachandra justified. You see, I have a promise. Your brother Shugriv said, declared me as his friend, and my friendship is, I take the vow, I, I have a place. Whoever will call me his friend, I will save his life. So he was, you are killing, so I, to save his life, I kill you. And morality ethics you are teaching. What morality ethics? In the scripture it is said the junior brother's wife should be uh, seen and uh, treated 
as the daughter. You exiled Shugri and you have taken over his wife, me, his senior brother. Forcefully, Tara. You are, is it, is it Dharma? You are teaching me Dharma? I am following the Dharma. I know my Dharma. You have been doing all kinds of bad things. But that's the difference. Do you have any enmity with, on, with me? You are fighting directly with me or not? It is not that. God has come to establish Dharma. So God had to. So this Ravana did something wrong. Why the whole Ravana cl clan was finished? There was no one to give the uh, 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 Mukhagni, what do you call that, cremation, They're doing the final rites. Bibishan by himself, Ramchandra Ji says, Bibishan, do it yourself. They don't understand. What wrong they did? Everyone did not uh, uh, eat um, uh, Shitama. It, it was, it was uh, eat um, uh, Ravana. But his son, his brothers, his subjects, his army. So, because they have supported the wrong guess. So, Bali was doing something wrong, which is not Dharma. So, all Nagutarus came at their time to establish what was good at that time and what was wrong. 1400 years back, this one prophet, Muhammad, has came in a, in a desert area. No food, no this. They, they are all Bedouins. Bedouins mean this uh, place to place they go for their e. They don't have any motherland concept. Any fire we, we get our uh, understanding is completely on the physical body. I have to remain survive, survive myself, whatever is available, whatever place is, because I do not have anything. That philosophy cannot fit Indian philosophy, which is a place for thousands of years, people feeling, and there are mantras. Matri Eje, Janani, Janbo, Bhumishya, Sarvgad, Pitagariyoshi. They worship the land, considering our Bhagavato, Mother Earth was praying, when you will come, Bhagavan, so many bad things is going on, you come, incarnate yourself in the Bhagavato. There. there is no concept, such concept in those. So don't try to find fault with that. They solve the local problems, problems of that time, problems of that land, problems of those people. So, same God comes, incarnates. So God is small, better, big, it is not that. Only with our materialistic mind and understanding, physical uh, way of understanding, we see, oh, this is this, this is this. Rajaguna is less uh, pure than Sattu, less valuable. Tamasik, Tamaguna, all is in God. Triguna, Tita, Guneshwar, Sham, Radha, Madhava, Radha, Ashwam, Triguna, Tita. Yes, Sri Krishna, you are beyond the Gunas. You are the Gunas, you are the Lord of Gunas. All Gunas come from you, but you are beyond. Sri Ramakrishna's prayer, Swami Vivanda composed. Kandana Bhava Bandhana Jaga Bandhana Bandhita Maya Niranjana Nara Rupa Dhara Nirguna Guna Maya You are Nirguna, without any attribute, without any adjective, but Guna Maya, all adjectives, all attributes, all power, all qualities come from you. You are the source of all. You are the substratum. Try to understand. In God, certain philosophies are there. Satan and God separate. Then Satan is also if our God becomes a little limited with your own logic. So if Satan is there, means events are there, that is also a part of God. If I have a head, which is the highest place, we all we always it, it, it is the highest thing. Then I have a leg also, I have a toe also, but it is part. Leg and fingers are not that valuable, like um, that important, like heart or lung or brain. But 
Brain cannot do the what the leg is doing. Leg cannot do the what the fingers are doing. That cannot be done by the heart. So, but all with total all you, you have certain uh, organs also. This extra excreta is this going? Is it very thing? We, we we cover it. We, we do not talk about it. We do not name it. But can you live without all these things? All these openings. So one has to be very not fanatic, not dogmatic, uh, not um, uh, this uh, um, uh, indoctrinated with some wrong ideas and ideology. Then problem. So God is one, but in different avatars he plays different roles. In Sri Ramakrishna, Swami Vivekananda found that compared to the pro problems in other yugas, other avatars did not have to do and <coughs> confront and give solution of so many things as Sri Ramakrishna did. Sri Ramakrishna came to pro solve the problem of the whole world, these ideas. And that is why it has been spread in such a way. Vivekananda, Noren Shikha Devi. Long back Sri Ramakrishna wrote it when he could not talk, wrote it on a piece of paper that Noren, Jaya Radhe Premamohi, Premamohi. Noren Shikhedev. What Noren will teach? He cannot teach. Nobody challenge. Nobody said anything. But gradually, gradually, all these things unfolded. Noren wanted to remain completely absorbed in Samadhi, Nirvikal. That is why in the Pranam Mantra it is there. Paratate Sadalino Paramintis Paratpara Paramatma Tvatpo. It is a principle. It is not a form. It is not something that you can show. It is not a matter. It is a principle. It is Tattva. Parata, te sada, lino, always lean, absorbed. Nirvikalpa samadhi means there is no vikalpa. There is no, nothing else is there only. It is formless. It is attributeless. Nirgo, nirakar. Avang manusha gochana. Beyond the thought and speech, tongue, any organ. He was remaining absorbed in that. And Sri Ramakrishna Bharata Te Sadalina Ramakrishna Sama Adgaya Adgya order. Instruction from the Ramakrishna. Hey, no, you cannot remain sitting in Orin. You are not born for that. You have to do mother's duties, activities. You have to go to the outer world. You have to please this Vedantic divinity where people do not know that sinar, 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 sinar always. Original sin. I have not done anything. Your father has done sin. I, what my father has done? Why I will suffer for that? No, there is original sin. To wipe away, wipe out your sin, you have to come to God. You have to uh, pray to God. You have to worship God. And Vedanta, the first book of this knowledge and holy instructions, this book. That also in the in the beginning it was not a book form. I do not know that somebody was telling that Jesus passed away and within 17 or 70, 17 or 170 days the Bible was written by all the twelve. They were at that time saving their life. Cannot say I am a follower of Jesus. Then he will also be killed. And all sat there as if it was all planned. Jesus said. I do not know whether it is the correct things or devotees, they, that is the problem. Devotees become dogmatic and fanatic, they say anything and everything. They were at, the, at a shock that such a man, our guru, our teacher, Jesus says, it's gone. It is so, such brutal way. And now they will bring light to the whole world and started writing Bible. It is not that. I don't, I don't believe that is, that is a good thing. It came. Yes, reminiscence, different. As Vedanta came. No one can claim it is of Urushio. Coming from the Gurus, those who realized gradually, he said to it, his son, his son, his son, his, son, his child, uh, disciple, 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 Guru Parampara. They could not, Jesus himself said, Peter, within the three the sound of the morning, cocks, you will deny me. No, no. Whoever denies, I will never leave you, I will not do it. At the gunpoint he said, no, no, I do not know, I do not know. 
I don't know. And cock, cock, cock. That it was that. Me, hen, and uh, what is it called? Opposite. Rooster. 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 That that sound. Yeah. Crow. 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 <coughs> he used to be having shivering. Yes. Jesus said, but don't think that is wrong. Huh? You are the rock. On you I will build up my edifice. Edifice. What? So much. It is. So how is all the children will be together and will sit together and start preaching? They were saving their lives. Nobody accepted Jesus's religion before Constantine. Constantine, uh, the king, after 500 years. Then actually everything started preaching the philosophy, ideas to the world. And people also understand, gradually, gradually are understanding the sacrifice of the, the this um, Jesus Christ, the Son of God. In his own time, he said, those who are non-believers, will they believe? If you tell that I have just come from the heaven, Father is there, they will, they will, they will say, yeah, fraud, fake, huh? is a hypocrite, lying, they will not believe. So, I do not know that it is justified and it is uh, logical and rational to say that uh, within 17 or 770 days uh, it, it, they started writing Bible. And they are busy to save their lives and denying that. No, 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 we do not know Jesus. Because if you say you have been in Jesus' company, then you will be slaughtered like Jesus. So however, I come to that. They did their best to establish uh, the dharma, righteousness, good things in that time, where it was necessary, use Rajaguna and Tamaguna. This, when Sri Krishna was conducting, helping the uh, uh, Kurukshetra battle, this Pandavas and Kauravas, Sri Krishna was telling that Yudhishthira will not lie, and Dronacharya said that I will not stop fighting today, and <clears throat> what I will do? Uh, I will stop fighting only if my son dies, was, whose name was Ashwatthama. Otherwise, I will not stop. And that day, it's God's, all God's play. The same God who, who is being worshipped as the Avataros, Krishnastu, Bhagavan, Swayam, God completely, Purno expression, the full, full embodiment of God in Sri Krishna. It is in the Bhagavata. Krishna is the Swayam, Bhagavan, the same God has come, incarnated as Sri Krishna. And he himself is there. But he cannot save them. See the divine place. So we should not be too smart about understanding and uh, applying and de uh, uh, describing about godly things, divine things, which uh, direct experience is not there. God has come and t t t telling somebody, it is right, it is right. The Panditas, that is what it is there. Ekam sir, Viprabhu Truth is one, but different scholarly people, different sadhakas, according to their understanding, realization, they say. So, each has become the ocean of knowledge, Veda. I knew one Mahabhakka, yes, Tattamushi. Somebody says, Ayamanatma Brahma. Another one said, Aham Brahma. Four Mahabhakkas are there. Sarvam Kalidam Brahma. So, like this, what I am telling you, the different time, different rishis, seers of the truth, what they said, that has become the Vedas. It is not one day, and it was not by one person. So, Vedas is Apurusha, not created or started by, founded by Hinduism, Vedanta, by one person. Other paths, the Semitic religions, it depends on somebody. It has said, I have got a revelation, this is this. So, they solve their problem, but point is, they are all one. <coughs> we, as a follower, admirer, lover of God, we are appreciating, oh God, that role was very nice. Meditation posture, Buddha, we 
always appreciate ah, how good this like that. So what I am telling, Vivekananda wrote different letters to somebody and he is not a person with ordinary intellect and understanding and if he is not, his tongue was not that loose that anything and everything he would say out of emotion. So that is what I am telling. Many people had their, this, oh, many, many avatars came and in the Bhagavata, avatara asamkhya. This, this e, e uh, incarnations will be Asankhya, countless. Because this Srishti is not getting to be end today. And we have known everything of the e, uh, uh, this Srishti, this creation. It is not that. Up to this point, we know this, this, this happened in history, these, these things are recorded, prehistoric time, but we understand and try to analyze this, try to uh, um, uh, explain this with the, our limited understanding. So whatever it may be, God is one, Vivekananda did not like to uh, belittle anyone uh, and uh, uh, any avatars. Every avatar, what lecture? When he, he used to lecture on Jesus Christ, people used to come. We have not seen Jesus. We have seen the description in the Bible. So we take refuge in you. Means they wanted to be converted from Christianity to Hinduism. Well, Swami said, you are comparing me with Jesus. 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 Had I been in Nazareth at the time of Jesus, I would have washed his feet, not with my tears, but with my heart's blood. You are comparing Jesus. You have already Jesus. What another God you need? Try to understand the magnanimity of the personality. When he was giving a lecture on Buddha, two hours after that audience come, Swamiji, what is your own religion? Are you Buddhist? They do not know the correct pronunciation. Buddha, it is not bud. This bud of the flower, bud, bud level. So, Swamiji understood that really. Understanding is very superficial. I said, no, my dear, I am not a Buddhist. I am a flowerist. <laughs> so you cannot pronounce Buddha properly. If somebody is Jesus' is lover of Jesus, admirer of Jesus, if you just say, oh, I say, who is Khrushchev? Uh, who is Jusis? Who is Jasus? <coughs> Do you like that? If somebody is mispronouncing uh, your father, mother, so he also made the prank. Uh, said, no, I am not a Buddhist, I am a flowerist. Somebody said, you, are you Buddhist? How are you? What is your religion? Somebody said, truth is my religion and universe my country. His brother disciples are calling him back. Oh, everyone has, has accepted that Vedanta, Hinduism, uh, worship of the uh, different gods, these are all valid. Oh, our, our religion has got validity and our Sri Ramakrishna's Chela's disciple, they have limited understanding, they are telling that Sri Ramakrishna has come only for Calcutta, only for Bengal, only for India, only for that 16 uh, uh, disciple, monastic disciple, come back. Now again we will be doing whatever our Rishi Muni is doing because they are used to uh, live the life of that type of conservative, that uh, 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 ancient way of Sadhu Santu. They don't like any war, they don't like any uh, meeting, they don't like lecture, they don't like preaching, they don't like anything. Welfare activities. Every time they were troubling Bibhikanda when he went back. Bibhikanda is still intuiting that India can claim only, I am only for Bharat Bursa. I am not, I am, I am for the whole world. No country should claim me. I am for every country. I have many words here, they need me. And when yes, time will come, I'll go back. But not now. They are calling after the meeting some good news here. Now finish and come back. Limited understanding. So Vivekananda was a Jnana Shudya, a Suya, a, 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 a son of knowledge. So he would not say um, meritless uh, logic, he would not say, and a statement without any validity. So all avatars had their contribution. What they did is, <coughs> I will just read from a book. The, they did their 
they preached this truth, Moses, Muhammad, hmm, according to the need of their age, relieving the people of their burdens because God relieves our burdens. That is why God is called Hari, Haran Kore. God, Haran means stealing away. God's name is Hari. Why? He, Haran, does the Haran. What is Haran? Haran means removing, stealing. What? God also steals. Yes, God steals from the devotees, their suffering, their problems, their worries, their miseries. Why it will go? Nothing will go. This whole world science has proved. This matter, energy, this, that, in this universe it will remain. You can you cannot it you can it can be transformed from one state to another one. Neither anything you can create new nor you can destroy anything. Mass total, sub total some total will be always remain. So God takes away the suffering of the that is why it's Kori. Hori comes from horror, horror meaning to steal. God steals away our suffering and the burden of the worldly life. He comes in different forms from a fish to the highest human being according to the need of the time. These Hindus worship fish also. It proves that thousands of years back they had the understanding, this evolution going on fish avatar, then uh, baraha avatar, tortoise, egg, then uh, e avatar, um, uh, pig avatar, then uh, nishing half man, half uh, animal avatar, nishing uh, half man, half lion avatar, ramchan, like this, like this. The avatars also, as it, were, it appears, we can say with our limited understanding, that they are also being evolved to a higher level and higher level. Theory of evolution not only in the nature, here also in spiritual life also we find the, the latest, Sri Ramakrishna is the latest and the most perfect of all avatars, he said. What is Sri Ramakrishna? L-O-B-E, personified. If there be any love, Sri Ramakrishna. That is a song. <coughs> Trita Tari Ram Dwapade Roshan Ramakrishna Duhe Ekadhare Gautame Pran Shankare Rogan Avotir Nuloe Dharan Pare Like this, continue. What is the meaning of the message of the song? Message is Trita Tari Ram, whoever came was he embodied in Trita Yuga as Rama, in the Dapur as Shamo, Sri Krishna, and then Buddha, Chaitanya, Jishu, all, Avatara, Shankara, with knowledge. So now that same principle has incarnated, embodied again in the name of Rama Krishna. In him, you get all the virtues, powers, energies of the all past avatars in Sri Ramakrishna. Songs are not only songs, deep meaning is there, philosophy is there. It is time to explain in that way. So there are so many things we can think of. God is God, God is one. Be it in the form of Jesus, be it in the form of Buddha, be it in the form of Rama, but there are some, no, no, your God, they will not believe in that. If you equate their avatar, oh, no, no, I, I don't, your avatar cannot equate, cannot equal my avatar. Oh, no, there are people, fanatics, dogmatics, small-minded, narrow-minded, not understanding that vastness. If God is only present, then God cannot be present in my avatar also, your God. See the fallacy of their thought, logic. My God is all powerful, omnipresent, omniscient, present in everything. Seeing present in everything, why then your God is not present in Satan? God is not present in devils, in animals, in brutes, which you despise, which you look down upon, which you consider your enemy. So they are wonderful. You are in good, you are in bad. Tadduve, Tadanti, Yopanishad. You are here in the heart of earth and you are Dure, Dure. Yeah, as far as you can think, infinite is going. You are immanent, you are transcendent. So these ideas 
uh, if uh, your heart is not Sri Ramakrishna, understanding Sri Ramakrishna, accepting Sri Ramakrishna, if you are not a little bit uh, magnanimous in your thought and understanding, then it is difficult. Sri Ramakrishna, there is no narrowness. Sarva Sampradaya, all paths, sects, showing his respect, himself, Sampradaya Varjitam. Master in all paths, recognizing, validating. Other avatars came, they did not have to do that work of validating their past avatars, past path. Sri Ramakrishna is validating all. We would not have believed in Islam, we would not have believed in Christianity, we would not have be believed in uh, the other many avatars if Sri Ramakrishna would not have validated them and said, No, I have experience, I have taught, I have, I have done the other sadhana. Rama also is correct, Krishna also is correct. Buddha also is correct, Anuman also is correct. Equally Kali also correct, Krishna also correct. Shishu Krishna, Jesus, about Jesus, he would say, Shishu, baby, Krishna. Jishu, Jishu, uh, Shishu, Shishu Krishna. Sri Krishna understand he could not utter make too many English words, a few English words, and he would make joke. Noren thinks I am illiterate, I am not that illiterate. <laughs> Thank you. Means I can also speak one or two English words. Making joke, making fun. They can understand. See the magnanimity. Chala also is telling you are trying to take repose in me and comparing me to Jesus. Had I been at the time of Jesus, I would have watched this bit, not with my tears. How many Christians could say in this language? As the Lord said. Many fathers, many pastors, many missionaries said, you give a lecture in my because people start, stopped started uh, they stopped coming to the churches because there was a conflict at that time in 18th century 19th century gradually gradually the more and more the industrialization more and more science and technology are, are getting uh, power and, uh, developing advancing more and more they are finding problems that it does not corroborate with Bible. So we don't believe in Bible. These are all stories. There is always a fight with the Bible. This, uh, that where the sun moves around the uh, earth or earth moves around the sun. What is happening? There is a fight. Many are not scientifically true. I still remember we had some Muslim friends in, the, in our classroom. It was in 68, 69, 69, when some people uh, went, uh, this Neil Bohr, uh, they uh, uh, kept their feet uh, in, 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 uh, on, on, on moon. Their friends were telling, they are also, they were school students, uh, telling, and you see, our Maulavis are so e fanatic. They say, are we in the moon Allah stays? How can we do? They have brought some soil also, this art was well, all false thing. They have taken some soil from somewhere. These small lobbies will not believe. Some Muslim boys telling, you see, they are educated. They are not, we, are, we are reading science in the school and we know. And it, all our photographs are there. They are sending photographs also. It is not the something there. But they will say, no, no, it is, it is, it cannot be. Never, ever, anyone can go. But his Vedanta is completely scientific. Thousands of years back, what Rishi Munis did, said, many ideas are there. This, he, Dibbo, <coughs> divine chariots. This idea is there in Mahabharata, in Ramayana. Thousands of years back, when you could not, you were this, he, he brothers who, who uh, first uh, did the e, right brothers, this aeroplane. Thousands of years back, it is written there. It is not that yesterday Hindus wrote it and said, you see how it is. Thousands of years back, it is there. They had this divine vehicle, airplane. Name was something else. Pushpaka, Ratha. Flying from this place to that place, everyone could not use. Certain powerful kings. Expensive. <laughs> they had the power. But you see, the technology was not there. Missile. And without seeing this remote now, controlling, Arjun could do it. How? 
So somewhere some sound is there. It is called Shabda Vedi. Shabda Vedi Bhakti. Arjun only you, in you. Nobody. Arjun. Closing the eyes. You listen. It is hitting the target. Now I come. The, a little bit Tomo also Sri Krishna had to do. Dhrunacharya that was finishing all uh, he, uh, army uh, Pandavas and Pandavas. No mercy to anybody. Then Sri Krishna said, stop him. If he, he remains with the gun, with the bows and arrows, weapons, then he is a pratihata to take. Nobody can stop him. It is all divine play. Uh, if Sri Krishna is God himself, why he is not doing, uh, changing the thing? If Sri Krishna is God, why not in one day he could finish the war? And why he had the war? Why he did not say, hey, all, no war is there? Because we are born with different tendencies, is God is giving. Sri Ramakrishna sanctified, rectified our tendencies. Those avatars kill the Evil doers and new evil doers are born, being born, and problems is not being solved. What Sri Ramakrishna did? Sri Ramakrishna did is not only killing the asuras, evil doers, criminals. Take out the crime mentality tendencies, the rectifying them, transforming them. You remain in your religion, in your place, in your householder's life, in your dash life, in your this life, only you change your attitude. You are divine. Feel the presence of divinity within. I, am, I don't need to kill you. I am killing your bad tendencies. If one can do that, what a greater service contribution has been done by Sri Ramakrishna and Bhagavan to the whole world. Changing the attitude of the minds, propensities, inner tendencies, if those are purified, even though I am a Satan now, I am, a, I, am a, I am an Oshura, I am a devil now, I am a demon now. If my, why am I doing? Because my tendencies are being, my mind is impure, my intellect is polluted, my mind is polluted. But if my mind and intellect is purified, filtered, transformed, then I will become a Rishi. This, what uh, he, he did, um, Ramchand did his life, wrote Balmiki. What was he? A robber, a decoy, a doshu, a badmash, a ruffian, a rascal. What can? What was a meal? Buddha de, was a meal boy put together. So, Ram, Krishna, Buddha gave liberation to many, according to one or names are there. Sri Ram Krishna is, and Ram and Krishna had to use Rajaguna and little Tamaguna to win over, destroy the Adharma and establish the Dharma. Sri Ramakrishna completes Sattvaguna. Sattvaguna is always at the top. Down is lowest is Tamu, middle is Raja. You have to come to Sattva through Rajas. Everyone, we all have Tamu, we all have Rajas, we all have Sattvas. But the Guna, the quality, is being reflected through my behavior and treatment, conduct. We call that it is a very sad. It doesn't mean I don't have any tamashina, I don't have any radhishina. In Sri Ramakrishna, complete sati. He cannot do anything radhishina. He takes the help of Vivekananda to spread message. This is radhishina. Good thing. But, so Sri Krishna said, tell Yudhishthira, if Yudhishthira says that Ashutama is killed, then no more, then I will give up, otherwise not. So today you tell Yudhishthira says, I cannot lie. I will not tell. And Dronacharya knows that Yudhishthira will never lie. Now Sri Krishna, ah, come here. A beam. There is an elephant. Its name is Ashutama. Beam chopped off the head of Ashutama. That uh, what is that? Elephant in a distance, at a distance. Not Dronacharya to see. Then. Sri Krishna is telling, now, Ashwatthama Hato, you shout. I am not telling man Ashwatthama, Dronacharya San Ashwatthama, but I am hiding something. That thing. I am telling, Ashwatthama Hato. <laughs> then Sri Krishna said, Ipti, Gajo, Sayanti, said that. I, I did not say, Dronacharya, you listen to me, I am telling you. It is not that. 
I am shouting, Asatamahato, eating gaju. Iti, gaju means this. The elephant whose name is Ashottama is killed, is no more. Dronacharya heard Ashottama Hato, oh God, Yudhishthira is telling through, through his weapons. And I, not, I was living for my son. I will not do any fight anymore. I will also give up my body. What is there with my son? You see the Maya, they were all Brahmaganis, but still, how Maya is thinking, my son, my son, my son, there is no more. Such a wonderful person. Ah, you don't try to criticize, you cannot become an, or, or, neither Arshuttama nor uh, we cannot become, it is so. But see, all are under the spell of Maya. It is going on. It is a statement of fact. Maya is there. Some is still, what is Maya? It is a statement of fact. It is there. We feel Maya is there. We cannot say Maya is not there. So, point of view, you can question. You have the right. Answer is there. You will do everything in an other way, and if I react to stop you, to save me, and a killing is bad, you are killing me so to save myself. You have already killed my father, already killed my four brothers. I am just to save myself. I killed you. I have the power. I killed you. Now you are, hey, killing is bad. How can you kill me? Oh, killing my father, killing my brothers. That was not dharma. You are teaching Dharma to me. So, answer is there. But, from the highest point of view, Satyagun, working Satyagun, changing the attitude of the evil doers, destroying the evils within, not the evil doer. Is not it prevention is better than cure? Is not it more powerful? You kill one Oshudo, another Oshudo will come, is being born and and I am killing the Ashuri Bhava, the tendencies of the Asura, they will demoniac, demoniac tendencies in the minds of all. Is your power more? You have shown. Or uh, my power is more. So from that point of view, some Yudhanta can say that Sri Ramakrishna's contribution to the whole world, this message, that I am not killing the Dushkrita, Dushkrita. I am killing the Dushkriti within, who, not only him, in everyone. Bringing a new society will come, a new change will come. Vivekananda said with the birth of uh, advent of Sri Ramakrishna, the Satya Yuga has come, all good days are coming. It will take time. But we, will must, we, must be, we must be hopeful, positive, optimistic. So, that is another point of view. So many things are there. Now, you see, I just know. Though Hindus accept Buddha as an avatar, he did not teach from the Vedas because he thought that too much reasoning about the scriptures was useless because you can hundred times read the scripture, you cannot become enlightened. Sri Ramakrishna is telling, Pothi Parke, Pothi means scripture, Parke means reading, Pandit Bhare, one becomes a good scholar, can give, erudite scholar, can give lectures, but Gyani na Bhare but he is, cannot become the realizer of the truth. You cannot enlighten yourself, you cannot free other, yourself, but I am lecturing, uh, freeing others. It is, I am quoting only. So you are a good quoting man, you are a good scholar man. Ravana was the Vedagnya. Whole Vedas was contest of everything was in his. He was selected by Ramchandra as the, his priest to kill Ravana. Ravana was not an ordinary man. But in the Vedas and Upanishads, it is written that you uh, 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 steal the wife of somebody else forcefully. And his own wife, Mandadari, was telling, What is this, my dear master? We have so many wives. Why you need at this age another wife? And it is somebody else's wife. Our scripture do not give it. 
if you are married and my unmarried one at the end with her consent. In those days, they tried to pacify Ravana. Vibhishana tried, uh, 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 Mandadari tried, uh, 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 Hanumanji tried. But Ravana, knowing all the Vedas, having so many sadhanas, one cannot become Ravana. All the Navo grows under his feet. Nobody could do any camp, no making, no sound. Ravana's power was there. He had the power to make steers, shiri, steers from up to heaven. He had the power to change the whole ocean, to convert it from water ocean to salty water ocean to a, uh, a nectar ocean. He had all this. Ravana was not an ordinary personality. But see, Sri Ramakrishna is telling, don't kill the wrongdoer. Kill the e tendency, wrongdoing tendency inside. So, from that point of view also, Sri Ramakrishna, Swami Vivekananda can say, Swami Vivekananda only can say what? And now what he said? But contribution of all avatars are there. And Buddha Dev was telling there was too much of living in this. So the goal of life, which was the attainment of liberation on what he called Nirvana, could not be attained by scriptural knowledge. So he was silent about the scriptures. Live it. Live a good life, honest life, pure life, pure thought. Ashtarandik, this path. Is, as I have got the Nirvana, you will also. So because he has got Nirvana, his followers has made another path. But Hinduism is, Vedanta is like an ocean. All paths, all everything as I have quoted from Shiva Mahindra with Swami Vivekananda quoted in the Parliament of Religion that all rivers having their sources it will actually come into the same. <coughs> and ocean is unaware of it. Gita, Bhagavan is telling Arjun, when you become a Sita Prabhu, all your senses are there, but they cannot re act on your mind, everything, everything under control. As many rivers are entering into the ocean, ocean's water, neither it swells up, goes up, nor it becomes ocean and ocean. So, yes, this man of steady uh, he, wisdom, Sita Prabhu, he becomes like that, unaffected by anything calm and quiet. Hundreds and thousands of rivers are always entering, putting their water in the ocean. Ocean does not have any feeling. Coming, going, whatever. So, when that enlightenment comes, now he is telling, I have got enlightenment through my sadhana. You give up your Vedas, Upanishad, God's Goddess, God is there or not there, or you leave. Parokal is there or not there. In this Kalo, in this life, we find that there is suffering, there is the root of suffering. There is the uh, he, uh, made, uh, solution of suffering, there is the process, path of, to remove the suffering. So come and follow me. They made it. You said, wow. Jesus Christ said something, Judaism. <laughs> Jesus Christ, this Christianity has swallowed the mother body, the Judaism, this uh, Jewish. You see, they don't have even any land. They are themselves, but something told this in the permanent religion. But in Hinduism, ah, he is a rebel child of Hinduism, Buddhism. Mm -hmm. So that uh, he did not uh, give any uh, value to the scriptures, was silent about the scriptures. He taught by his own life the truth of the Vedas, though he did not acknowledge their authority. Because his followers did not honor the Vedas, they lost the support of the Indian people who look on the Vedas as their chief authority. Thus, after some time, Buddha's religion declined in India. Those who in Indian land will not give, pay respect to Vedas, Vedic truth, to the experiences of the seers, their thought, their mind, their uh, analysis, people will not accept. People be, became attracted with the life of Buddhas. But when his followers started Buddha, did not do any wrong to his followers started because Buddha did not uh, uh, say that you have to do all Vedic things. In Vedas there is Karma Kando, Kano Kando. Buddha is telling, have the practical thing, practical Vedanta. 
you have problem it has this root there is a solution to root it out and there is a process and there is you become enlightened so why you are giving so much value this part that part this god that god you have to bring experience the need one of yourself you have to do your karma so he believed in the good karma and his followers started neglecting and belittling and not paying respect so this buddhism has declined in him then came sri shankaracharya to re establish the vedas because vedas were not being with buddhist power space was so much that everyone became buddhist at one point of time whole india became buddhist almost 80% but everyone hmm. this modern time in calcutta people they are not no we are not in we are brahmo brahmo move now rabindranath after what said you see the ram krishna mission the whole brahmo movement has been swallowed by the ram krishna people go to ram krishna mission but why is brahmo samaj no samaj no follower no ramos for a day Raja Maharaj and he, uh, Shami Bhavananda and Shami, we were going to both, uh, were the members of the Brahma Samaj. So one day, Brahma Samaj, they have to, some place is there. We will not kneel down before any statue, any murti. Because God is omnipresent, God is not present. Hare, Master said, Hare, if you are God, formless God is present everywhere. The in my Mahakali's murti cannot be present there. He is present. Other than mukti, outside mukti, your God cannot remain present in uh, my. If you tell God is present everywhere, then God cannot be present in 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 Makali's mukti. No one could not answer. Then Master said, Rakhal has bhakti now. God with form. Why you are disturbing him? That is why he is going to make pranams in Kali Mandir. Uh, 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 Shiv Mandir, Krishna Mandir. Uh, don't tell him anything. You have scolded him. He has uh, shivari. Uh, Rakhal Maharaj Swami Bhagwan will not go to the Shrinivasa when Narayan is there. Because Narayan, uh, when Narayan is not there, at that time he will go to Mandir, uh, temple and make pranam and feel him. Uh, now I am troubled for him. Otherwise Narayan, Narayan is Narayan. I, truthfulness, you sign that you will not he um, uh, kneel down salute any murti any statue sri ramakrishna has not come to break anything they are breaking something and trying to create new something no brahmana no buddhist now he will uh, denigrate belittle vedas and vedic he experiences rishis munis then people will not accept Shankaracharya came to re-establish the Vedas. You see, Shankaracharya was so merciless, you see. What he did? Come, you establish that Mimamsha, Karma Kandra is better or the Dhyana Kandra is better. Advaita Vedanta, you come, if you can establish your truth, I will die, I will sit on... That, that day it was the, the, the condition. If you are defeated, you have to enter into the... He, uh, they call it uh, tush, tushanol, this husk of the paddy. It takes time to burn. You have to sit uh, uh, where uh, fire is there in the, that husk of the heat. Gradually, gradually, two days, three days, four days, it will take to burn fully. You will sit there with that four days, five days. You are burning, burning. It is not that I finish you one time, one hit, one kill. I so It is not. Four days, five days, whatever day it is, you are 24 hours burning, burning, and dying. Shankaracharya said, "Come." Many people died in that way, or you got converted to me, to Patsatya. So to establish the Vedic truth <coughs> again, Shankaracharya thought to be an incarnation. This thought to be an incarnation of Shiva. Sri Shankaracharya came with the splendor of knowledge. All knowledge seemed to be. embodied as buddha was compared that love compassion uh, shankara is embodiment of knowledge and in ramakrishna in that song treta tari ram dapara rasam in ramakrishna that knowledge of shankara 
and that heart of Buddha, devotion of Chaitanya, 24 hours, shedding tears, Hari Bol, Hari Bol. So, and Krishna's that intelligence and karma, Sri Krishna is ever working. Adbhuta karma kalevar, Sri Ramakrishna will compose that, that Narodeva Deva, Jaya Jaya Narodeva, Narodeva Deva. Adbhuta Krishna, it is wonderful. But they always ever engaged to do good to the world. So, Sri Ramakrishna about Sri Ramakrishna Samiji is telling that this, this Sri Ramakrishna's life, it is not always sitting and meditation. He was a karma yogi. And what type of karma he did? He did this kind, kind of karma. Always about Sri Ramakrishna, it is there that. Achandala Pratihatara Yashu Premos of Dikito, Noro Devo Devo, Jai Jai Noro Devo, Shokti Samutra Samutta Tarango, Dorchito Premo, Vijim Ritarango, Prem Love has taken the form and doing all these things. Samsa Rakshasa Nasa Mahatma. You have finished the Rakshasa of Samsa Dao. God is or God is not. Sriam Prishna, Are God is. I have experienced. You don't need to give up your whole life whether God is, then I will meditate on God. If God is not there, what is our religious life? What is my spiritual practice? Start spiritual practice now, it's a God is. Samsa, this confusion, doubt in, in the E of uh, existence of God, finished. Many people are become agnostic, atheist, non-believers. They thought God cannot be sincere. In Christian churches, people are not coming. They invited Vivekananda, Vivekananda was going and then more people coming. They are coming to hear about Jesus, about Dharma, about this, about that, from some you Vivekananda. Know, and they were getting again full their congregation in church. So, Samiji is telling that Adbhuto, and Kalmo Kare Varam, Adbhuto Chestam, Yami Gurum, Saranam Bhogat. Adhya Tattva Samahita Chitta. Adhya Tattva. You did so many work. Worshipping in Murti, but completely absorbed and embodied, established in Advaya, oneness. With form also you are doing puja. With formless also you are equally. You are experienced and expert in every or every field with all religions, all religious ideas, all philosophical ideas. Karma, Gyan, Bhakti, Yoga, everything. Gyan, Gyan. So, in Sri Ramakrishna, all these things, in its fullest, highest state, condition, was seen in those days. So, that is another side, Shankara, as a knowledge. Jesus Christ came to destroy the sins of all mankind. Christians say that original sin is disobedience to God. The biblical story of Adam and Eve and the original sin has been told previously. And it is discussed in the God sent his son, Jesus Christ, to save people from his this sin. Christ by his crucifixion accepted the sins of all men and saved them. Next came Muhammad, who tried to destroy the darkness of ignorance in which the Arabs were drowned. They did not have any idea. Completely this uh, Eve people Tribal people fighting, headhunter, each other fighting always. Each tribe that survival, the competition, battle for survival of their existence. No food. If you eat, I, I cannot eat. This group, that group always, more than 250 courageous group, they used to fight for their own survival. So there was, there was a question of challenge of their existence. So they also did this. Sri Chaitanya came. Shankara came, Shankara said, Brahma Sattam Jagan Mitha, Jeeva Brahma Dona, established Advaita Tattva, which science cannot challenge. This is, it is, it is the best rational thing. It is not, I believe in God, so it is not that. Completely, logically, rationally, scientifically proving that the whole universe is one and the only one. And modern science is telling, yes, there is one consciousness only. One energy only, one matter only, and everything together are actually finally one because it transforms. In Vedanta is telling, whatever is trans 
changed, that is not real. Unchanged one is there. And we believe in that. We call that Brahman. We call that Paramatma. We call that Parabrahma. We call that Nirgu, Nirakar. That is Abhakta, unmanifested. But when it manifests itself, we call it is Shakti, it is Avatar. Whole cow is there. You touch the horn, you touch the leg, but you cannot get milk from anywhere. Sri Ramakrishna is telling, you get the milk only through avatar, hmm. only through the others. What is there? This, this, there. Where is God? What? Who can show? Where you feel that godliness, that divine quality, yesterday I was telling in the 26th one, perhaps I quoted. The in avatar you feel, what is written in the scriptures, in the books, about God, about godliness, about goodness, about purity, about chastity, about love, about compassion, everything to its highest. He, uh, present, he presents fullest existence, we find presence in the uh, reflection, in the life and teachings and behavior. Of the other. So if you want to know God, you know it through. If you want to see God, you see through the other. So, Brahma Satyagyam with the Shambhara is wonderful contribution. Shaitanya Dev came, Guru Nanak came, they also took birth in India. They tried to remove the caste system and class distinctions. Ah, you are Brahmin, I am Shatriya, you are Shudra, I am Bhushra. These are all these things. Ah, you are trader, I am king. The community and Brahmin community, all this, they were lower apart, all these things, caste and class community, distinction and these fights and misunderstanding, and were both avatars of love. Through love, they destroyed the gulf between the high and low, rich and poor. They leave all those things. Holy Mother of Sindhu Chere, in Jarambati Kamarapur, all people, kinds of people are coming. White people, they would not touch because they are richer in those days, they believed in. Because they don't look like their skin, so these people don't belong. They are blechamins who are not purified. We are cultured, we are Sanskritas. We are cultured, we are purified race. Uh, we speak Devo Bhasha, the language of Devos. Yours is profane language, your language is... So all this misunderstanding, superstition, smallness, narrowness. Sri Ramakrishna called it, you know, Holy Mother allowed Nivedita to sit on her own bed, eating the, with them, handshaking with them. See, 130 years back, a lady born in a completely remote uh, village, showing all this wonderful magnanimity of mind and reason and logic and openness and love and accepting all, yes, all the children of God in the bed. It is written thousands of years back. No white, no black, no distinction. No Indian, no American, no man, no woman. Amrita Shaputra, all of the children of that immortal beast, you all have the right to enter into the kingdom of heaven. You think of father, you think of mother, but there is a heaven. Means good. And that heaven comes down to the world in the time of Shatya Yuga. Shatya Yuga means all rishis, munis, all following the path of Shatya, truthfulness, love, compassion. Honesty, purity, chastity, everything they follow. No adulteration, no deviation from the truth, no mixing of this and that and hybrid making. Purity itself, personification, love, personification, personified truth. All mm. these people are there where that becomes a heaven. You send some satans and demons in the heaven, they will make it hell. So, with the Shatya Yuga, all these things come. And this rich and poor, this Chaitanya Dev, Guru Nanak, they did their best to bring equanimity, love in the society, equality in the society. Referring to the period after Nanak and Sri Chaitanya, Swami Vivekananda said, at this time someone was needed in whom could be found the knowledge of Shankara and the love of Chaitanya, the mind of Shankara and the heart of Chaitanya. Thus Sri Ramakrishna came. He embodied in himself both love and knowledge. Sri Ramakrishna said about himself, Shami, I am quoting Vivekananda. This, he who was Rama, he who was Krishna is now this Ramakrishna. He also said, 
this time God has come in disguise, like the king who sometimes wanders about incognito mm -hmm. to find out for himself the condition of his people. Simply himself said, no showing of I am king's son. He, Shankara's wonderful talent, Pandit scholarship, Buddha, <laughs> son of king, living everything, you see how great a condition being born in a poor, remote village, having no education, nothing, no attributes, so-called, outside attraction to the world. Deen, Hind, Kangal, no education, no uh, uh, money, no wealth, nothing compared to others. See, Krishna was also born born in a, a, a prison house, but his father was the head of a clan there. Yeah. A small chieftain. It is also a small raja, like that. So, in Sri Ramakrishna, this himself, uh, Sri Ramakrishna was the king, the king of kings, God himself. He came in disguise to see for himself the suffering of the people and to lift them up. Avatar. That means to come down, avataran, coming down, for the uttaran, lifting up of the common people, his devotees, pious people. Vinashaya chatushkedam, sadhunam, paritrana sadhunam, vinashaya chatushkedam. To destroy the demoniac minded people and to save the holy people. Not only sadhus holy, householders, those who speak the truth, those who are honest, those who are show love, compassion, mercy, chastity, purity, honesty, unselfishness. Those people remaining as householders, they are holy people. Our Rishi Munis, many are, 70 percent are householders. So, God comes to save the holy people who believe in God, who believe in righteousness, who try to follow the path of righteousness. Sri Ramakrishna's father was given, they trying to bribe him. I will give you many places, you give one false witness, because uh, if Sri Ramakrishna's father tells anything in the court that that it is it, this property belongs to the Jaminda lender, then lender will get it, all falsity. Sri Ramakrishna's father left 200 vigas of land, everything, property, cannot fight with the... He is a simple Brahman, means thinking of Brahman. Who is a Brahman? Not being born in a Brahmin family, but living a life of a Brahmin. What is a Brahmin's life? Always thinking of Brahman. Brahman is Anathis of Brahman. Who knows the Brahman, the truth? He is a Brahman. You may be born in a cobbler's house. You may be white, you may be uh, African, you may be American, you may be South Asian, you may be somewhere. That is not the question. Where is your mind is? Attitude is. Sri Ramakrishna is coming. Change your attitude. I don't like to destroy the evil doer. I like to change their attitude, transform them. It is more power is needed. I can kill somebody, but I cannot make him friend, change his mind. mind. Mind is more valuable than the body. You can change the body, kill him, but you cannot change the body. Mental patients, physical e, 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 treatment you can do and you can bring comfort and mental patient. Days after days, months after months, years after years, you cannot change the mind. Evil tendencies in, in, in people, Sri Ramakrishna's contribution is to change their attitude. So, Sri Ramakrishna said about himself that in disguise, the Master said, I saw Satchitananda come to, of Satchitananda come of this sheet. It said that Satchitananda is telling, I incarnate myself in every age. I saw that. It was the fullest manifestation of the Satchitananda. But this time, the divine power <coughs> is manifested through the glory of Sattva. He is revealing in the Gita, Bhagavan Sri Krishna is still open, don't you believe? I am that, I am that, I am that. Revealing himself, Sri Ramakrishna is telling that. But in Sattva, not claiming I, I, I. In Krishna, God showed the Rajaguna. Rajo, according to the, our scripture learning, Raju is lower than Sattva. So, Sri Ramakrishna is the noblest, the greatest of all of the Taras. So, Vibhavananda has his understanding and 
evaluation. So that Shaktaguna, complete manifestation, divine power is manifested this time. But the glory is of Sattva. Sri Ramachandra and Sri Krishna had the splendor of kings, royal. They were royal power and glory. They were characterized by the Rajaguna, the element of dynamic activity. But Sri Ramakrishna did not have the bow and arrow of Ramo or the great missile of Sudarshan of Sri Krishna. He did not have the royal splendor of Buddha or the scholarship of Shankara and Chaitanya. In his incarnation, there was no splendor at all, only divine purity, adherence to truth, and a complete absence of egotism. These are the signs of the Swatika Guna, the element of purity in human beings. Sri Ramakrishna, love personified, compassion personified, Holy Mother, chastity personified. Pavitram, Jaritam, Jasya, Pavitram, Sri Ramakrishna and Holy Mother. Same avatar coming in, appearing in two bodies. As it were, in the commentary, Shankaracharya, in the Gita commentary, it says, God is birthless, deathless. But in the physical level, we think, we see that as it were, God was born, took a body. What body God got in? God is everywhere. But for the good of the humanity, teach us knowledge, give us knowledge, to teach us bhakti, to raise ourselves, Uttaram, God comes down to the higher sphere, to our level, to raise us up, to raise our minds up. And if our minds are raised to a higher level, we will not do any bad thing. That is the position. Sri Ramakrishna is giving more in stress there. Oh, we have to do uh, Arati now. Yeah. So we will continue with another lecture. Mm -hmm. So it is time. Now we will have our, uh, our evening aruti followed, followed by Prasad. Okay. So we offer, offer, we 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 offer,